Hey, it's Phil from Tips for a Better Life and let's talk about two different aspects of a relationship which people search. Hmm. On the one side, you have comfort, security, predictability, affection, good conversations. But on the other side, you have passion, you have desire, you have risk, you have variety, you have novelty. And those are two different things in the relationship which are important. If there's too much desire, risk, variety, it cannot give you enough security, you don't feel comfortable, and it can be a bit hectic, you know, and it's too much drama. But on the other side, when you have too much comfort, predictability, comfort, security, it can become a bit boring. It can become a bit like there's nothing new in this relationship. And a lot of people end up being in this spectrum. Their relationship is like very in the comfort zone, affectionate, almost like their family. Almost like they just hang out with each other like best friends, but there's no passion anymore. And that is because desire and what fuels desire and what fuels passion is novelty, is risk, is distance. It's hard to get, it's having to work for someone. So if passion and desire is lacking in a relationship, you should work on putting in novelty, creating distance, doing something risky together. A lot of times it's that attraction between having to work for someone and being attracted to someone because there's still new aspects that you want to discover. And the other thing is like, okay, it's like that this one is like fire, very heavy energy, very attractive, but it can burn when it's too much and too hot. And this is more like water, it's nurturing, it's calming, you know, it's predictable, it's comfortable, and we also need that. But that is the path that most relationships are going. So comfort you can create by just having security and getting to know each other. But comfort is also something you can have with friends. But you don't have friends with, with you don't have sex with friends or you don't have sex with family. You do have good conversations with them and you feel comfortable with them, but it's not just not sexual, it's just not super passionate. So if your relationship is lacking passion, you should work on creating desire. Do new things together. You have to work on that desire, else the relationship will become more like just being friends, like being family, instead of having that passionate relationship as from the beginning. Because in the beginning of a relationship, everything is new, everything is exciting, you explore new things together. But then you see, you get used to certain aspects of yourself and you get predictable and you don't get new input. So work on this, work on that desire, that distance, that, that, that developing new aspects in each other. Because then you see new things, then you fuel the fire, then you create the passion. So realize that these are, these are two aspects in a relationship which aren't always complementary. And it will definitely go this road if you stay together, but this road you actually have to work on. So this is just an aspect what I wanted to say about relationships. Think about it, let me know what you think, how do you keep the desire in your relationship and talk to you next time. Mm -hmm.